China's space station continued to be a hive of activity in 2025, with the arrival of the Shenzhou 20 crew in April ready for their six-month stay. The crew continued the 180 running or planned scientific experiments and conducted four spacewalks, as well as working to upgrade and maintain the space station. With this mission, Commander Chen Dong became the first Chinese astronaut to spend over 400 days in space cumulatively, also notching up the spacewalk record with six under his belt. The crew welcomed the Shenzhou 21 mission at the end of October. What delicacy! Look at them sizzling with oil. Amazing! They have the perfect color, aroma and flavor. Celebrating by cooking chicken wings and steak for the first time using a newly delivered hot air oven. But the return to Earth of the Shenzhou 20 crew was delayed by over a week after space debris hit their vessel, resulting in tiny cracks in a small window of their return capsule. Meanwhile, the Shenzhou 21's six-month mission continues as they prepare to receive another cargo spacecraft and hand over to a new team in 2026. There's speculation that an astronaut from Pakistan could join the team following an agreement between the two countries in early 2025, a milestone in Beijing's collaboration with international partners. Meanwhile, China has been busy with other space developments, including work on reusable rockets and launchers, low-Earth orbit satellites and deep space exploration. An example of the latter is China's creation of a near-Earth asteroid defense system. As part of this effort, the Tianwen-2 probe was launched to collect samples from a near-Earth asteroid. It's due to arrive in July of 2026, sending a capsule of rocks back to Earth the following year. 2025 also saw the launching of 12 satellites into orbit to create an AI supercomputing network known as the Three-Body Computing Constellation. The eventual aim, thousands of computers processing vast amounts of data in orbit, avoiding delays, data loss and the energy demands needed on Earth, as space has access to unlimited solar power. As the year closes, Chinese space authorities say they are on track for a crewed lunar landing by the end of the decade, while work to build an unmanned moon base by 2027 continues. The moon serves as a starting point, and the Lunar Research Station will provide a platform for long-term research, experiments and living, paving the way for humanity's journey into deeper space. It's the latest sign that China is looking to the skies as it pushes the frontiers of scientific discovery. Catherine Drew, CGTN.